Three years ago, I made a tutorial video on how to set up an MP bot for an OSA streamer using Streamlabs chatbot. Although this method still works fine, it has some flaws that don't make this method the most ideal one. So today, I have a new method for you guys. This new method uses a bot made by Sailing Waffle. He was kind enough to allow me to make a video, so please go show him some love and support on his Twitch when he's streaming. If you watch my old video, you might be wondering about the differences between this bot and that one. Well, this bot doesn't get their messages picked up by Mikuia, meaning that it won't clutter your Mikuia DMs. In addition, it is also updated real time, which means that it accurately gives the map link and information whether you're playing the map or in the song selection screen. Now, let's get started on how to install it. All the links needed will also be in the description. Okay, first go to this website, scroll a bit down, you'll see Node.js, click that. Depending on which uh, OS you have, 32 or 64, choose accordingly, mine 64. And while that's also installing, get this, the head does it. Put that into a folder, like so. And then while that's getting ready, also extract this. Open this up, click next, accept, next, 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 install. Okay, click finish. Rename this to whatever you want. Change this to .env. Now open a CMD, type in CD space, copy this, paste, enter, and then do npm install. When it's done, you can click X, open up .env with notepad. You'll see these four lines for bot username. I use my own Twitch channel, uh, but you can also make a separate account. Although I do recommend using the same as your actual channel to keep things simple. So Tofunim, and this is also Tofunim. With the OAuth password, you want to go to twitchapps.com slash tmi, connect, you'll see your OAuth password. Once it's pasted, make sure there are no spaces for these three lines as well as this one. For this one, you need Stream Companion if you don't have it installed. There are tutorials on YouTube and all that stuff as such. Files. And right here, you'll see the .txt file. For me, I named it mp underscore twitch. It might not be like this automatically. Again, there are tutorials on how to set it up properly. If you guys are still confused, then I'll either make a separate video or tell you guys all about it in the comments. It shows you name, difficulty, mapper, and then beatmap link. So change it as such, and then save. And then once you're done with that, you can just click start that bat. For me, it's automatically all ready to go. But if it's the first time, you need to type in npm space start. And after that, uh, every time you open it, you don't need to type in anything and it should run as such and you're done. Now I'm going to show you exactly how this MP bot is going to work. Make sure you have your MP bot up, which is the start that bat file, and then your string companion up. You need both of these up at the same time or else it will not work properly. The reason why is because string companion is the one updating the .txt file that you put up for the fourth line in your .env file. Meaning that if this isn't up, then you will keep on giving the same map over, over, and over again. You don't want that, right? You want it to be updated according to the song that you choose. So make sure you have both of those on. So I'll choose this collection and then press F2. Now I do exclamation mark MP. Same beat map, right? You can tell once you check the Twitch chat, it also gives you the correct information. Difficulty name is the same, mapper same, and beat map link obviously works accordingly. Press F2 again. MP again, correct. Fallen down, fallen down. Tomadoi, tomadoi. Beat map link works perfectly fine. And then one more for good measure. Alright, Rivers in the Desert, Final Resolve, Rivers in the Desert, Final Resolve, U Dragon, U Dragon, Beamout Link, or it's fine. So you can tell compared to the other one that I uploaded a couple years ago, this one actually works in the song selection screen, like I said. You press F2 one more time, and then do something like this. Go into the map. You know, playing, uh, pretend that I'm playing the map. And then somebody wants to MP this. XI, Futuring Star, Tiffer, Insane, Map by KTG Sir. Beamout Link completely fine and then you go back to menu and it's the exact same map given so it works since the song selection screen it works in game so it works basically whenever as long as the map is on the osu website so if it says not submitted that means there's no beat map link to give but you'll still get the information of this title and such that's basically it uh leave a like comment subscribe all that good stuff check out my socials i'll see you guys later bye